So, guys, um, just going through, Kelly, uh, what would you say is your greatest um, Wimbledon moment? Um, I think I think I have to go for winning the league. I'm gonna jump with. Um, I'm sure that's yours too, right? Yeah. Well, that's we right. were just talking about it actually that like winning the league, um, undefeated the season. Yep. Getting to go to Vegas after winning the league that's pretty good with the men. Yeah, with, with the men. Same the men. So we watched we watched them in their playoff game at Wembley. Then they basically come and joined us in Vegas. Yep. But you were there when you were a day earlier to yeah, we party went, a bit we, extra, yeah, right? Yeah, we went and... Okay. Set, set. And any scandal and gossip <laughs> from Vegas? Oh, what's happens in Vegas? Stays Stays in Vegas. Vegas. <laughs> <laughs> you know it. Fair enough, yeah, fair yeah, enough. So that's yeah, that's mine as well, to be fair. Just, yeah. It's got to be winning the league and the men the same year. Just the whole it club was, a was good just season. one. Just, it was massive for the whole club at that point. Yeah, it was, because I think before that there were a couple of cup wins, weren't they? The Surrey Cup, but this yeah, was this Surrey is cup. this is like the the most recent that and in the memory. Yeah, that was the most recent thing. One like you said, undefeated was just un, unheard of, wasn't it? And it yeah. was just a brilliant season. Yeah. So definitely the, the Invincibles. We were. <laughs> Yeah, top goal scorer. Hey. Definitely meant to Grand, grand. And um, Steph with an F. Um... <laughs> yeah, just in case viewers may spell it a different way. But uh... oh, I'm MPH as well. It's not even S T E S. Right, this is B A. Right, let's go. Yeah. Um, favourite moment to be fair it's probably signing for AFC um, mm -hmm. it was kind of at a time in my life where I kind of fell out of love with football again and yeah. I needed to something fresh to start again really and um, obviously having Kev approach me and coming down to the club it was the most amazing as vibe and mm -hmm. straight away kind of hit it off with the girls and it kind of all we had an amazing start to the season my first year I've been here for three years now and funny enough I've not completed a season yet so I'm still waiting for that one because of Covid obviously yeah, sure um, but yeah to be fair probably playing at um I've seen them playing for the shirt, and it's, it's a local club, and it's got the right morals and ethics. So signing for the club is my favourite moment. Yeah, oh, really, really cool, really cool. And how do you feel about planning? Um, it's amazing. It's something that we've been looking at, you know, in the in the past, and to play with someone where the men play and be together as one, like the girls have just said. Um, it'd be nice to be part of a a family, and hopefully to get more fans down. That will obviously increase the fan base, and obviously playing in a nice stadium. So yeah. Cool. Cool. Thanks, um, Steph and uh, Lauren. <laughs> Come on, Lauren. What would you say is your favourite um, Wimbledon moment? <laughs> <Don't know. laughs> oh, I'll I tell you what, Lauren, let's no, give I'm you here, a... I'm here, I'm oh, you're here, you're here. You're back. I'd say mine would be the same as Steph. Um, mm -hmm. I think for me, I fell out of love of playing football mm -hmm. and I just needed to enjoy playing again and go somewhere where I was happy and I think signing for Wimbledon I mean if you if you were to say a year ago I'd be here playing I probably wouldn't have said I would be but for me personally it's the best choice that I've ever made and I'm finally happy back playing with what what I enjoy doing and I love what I do um see so yeah, I mean and the way the ambition that the club have got the way that we're moving forward I think now it's the best it's the best time to be at the club Mm -hmm. everyone's really working hard behind the scenes to get the club going in the right direction so for me signing for Wimbledon was probably my greatest memory oh lovely like and, been <laughs> <laughs> and what, what, what do you how do you find it with um, you know with the other girls are you all mates uh, yeah, do, I mean, is it a really good vibe with, I think with you all for me the way that the club is like, I think all of us just in general the coaching staff the, play, like the players all of us get on really really well and we are we, it sounds a bit cheesy but I would look at us as a family like we don't some places you can go it can be clicky and you can have your groups but I wouldn't say that we have that here from the first day that I come down everyone just welcomes you and from the coaching staff to the playing staff everyone just welcomes you in opening arms and it's just a great club to be around lovely hey thanks thanks a lot and um Rosie blast from the past I think you've you've been here about 40 years haven't you <laughs> yeah, <laughs> yeah yeah what year did you actually join um, uh, the lady set up? Well, I did trial in probably 2009, but yeah. there wasn't a team then. So it must have when I was 10 years old. So, yeah, 2011, something like that. So, yeah, a long time ago. Yeah, yeah. And um, do you think you'll get a testimonial? 
It was 10 years, it's quite, no, no, it's quite, quite amazing, really. Yeah, but and I think it's been four years with the women's team now. It's mm -hmm. my fourth, 20 years old. Yeah, no, it's, yeah. My, it's my fourth season with the women, so yeah. Yeah, fantastic. And what would you say is your favourite um, Wimbledon moment? So mine was quite a personal one. It was scoring, I think it was my first senior goal, and it happened to be at King's Meadow. So being 10, like if I take myself back 10 years, and then that's what I was doing 10 years later, scoring it. King's Meadow is quite an amazing achievement, actually. And that was that was the midweek game. It was like a one-off, wasn't it, at King's Meadow? Yeah, it was. We hadn't played there. That was the only yeah. time we played where the men was playing. So yeah, yeah. To and now be really going, well. yeah, the winning going. I think like the ninety second. Yeah, yeah. I was actually yeah, at that. Was, I was actually oh, at really? that game yeah. on the pitch team. Yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah, <laughs> yeah I actually remember. Yeah, it. it was good fun. So now that. We're at Plough Lane, hopefully that can happen again, but I don't yeah. really score, so, so you who knows? Yeah. Yeah. Fantastic, fantastic. And um, Chloe, uh, waiting patiently, um, <laughs> what, what's your, what would you say is your favourite uh, Wimbledon moment? Um, similar to Rosie, I've not been here that long, but um, scoring my first league goal this season was pretty special. So I sort of waited a while, so I joined last year, and obviously we never finished the season because of COVID, and we never really got going. So this year to sort of come and score my first goal was quite a big achievement, I think. Mm -hmm. And what's going on? Because it's, you seem to be scoring loads of goals lately. I mean, is it 21 goals in the last few games? Yeah, last four games? Yeah, this is a team. I think we've we sort of had a tough start to the season where we sort of just something wasn't quite clicking. And then all of a sudden, the last sort of two, three weeks, everything's sort of fallen into place and just can't seem to stop scoring now, which is, is good. Brilliant. Well, best of luck, everyone, and um, look forward to um, seeing you all at Plough Lane. Thank you. <laughs>